You ready? Here we go. Hey, welcome to the show. Today in the show, we're gonna have a little fun using our Gamo air rifles. This is the Gamo Magnum. I got the Gamo Fusion right there also. And we're gonna be shooting water bottles, but these are modified water bottles. Let me tell you a little bit about this. You're gonna need the TR413 tire valve. And that is this right here. And then you go ahead and you make a little uh, hole inside your cap right there. And you're gonna need a uh, 5 16 uh, drill bit. Take your drill and put a hole right in the middle. Okay, after you put your hole in your cap right there using your 5 16 drill bit, go ahead and put your stem right through here. I need two hands to do that. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take this part uh, it works best for me when I'm putting this in a vise. Remember, when you put this in the vise, do not uh, damage the threads and don't squeeze this so much that you're going to dent this. So you got to have to use a little, a little smarts to be able to get just the right enough pressure to hold that in. Right, just like that. I might have to squeeze that a little bit more. And then what I do is I'll take like two wedges. I'll take a wedge on this side here and then another wedge right here. You can use screwdrivers if you wanted to. And then just lightly try to press this up. So I need actually two hands to do that too. So you're gonna do that until it just snaps right into place right here. All right, and you can definitely feel that when you uh, get into that groove right there. So now I'm gonna go ahead and take this off. And it should look just like this. And then you're gonna put that on your water bottle just like this. Hook it up to a uh, air pump. Now, when you put air in these water bottles, um, you're gonna put a lot of air. So go ahead and just set that down there. I'm gonna go ahead and pump some air in here. Put this water bottle so you can see it. You wanna try to put as much air as you can in there. The more air, the bigger the boom. Oh. Now I've tried different bottles like Gatorade bottles and uh, um, juice bottles, but the, this water bottle seems to be the, the one that works the best. And so now you can feel it. Um, it even feels warm. Uh, take a look at that. I mean, it's, it's really expanded. So right now we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna set that up and we're gonna use the Gamble Magnum. And we're gonna, I'm gonna show you what that sounds like. It's really cool. All right, remember, when you're shooting these, don't hit the stem. Um, I'll have a link down below where you can find these on Amazon. I love this gun, I do. All right, you ready for it? That is so cool. Let me go get that bottle. That just explodes. Uh, these are great if you're shooting archery um, or you know, using your pellet gun, uh, a lot of fun. Um, yeah, check this out. I'll have a link down below where you can find this on Amazon. A lot of fun. Oh my goodness, you'll wake up the neighbors on this one. And before we end the video, we gotta shoot one more. These are so cool. You ready? Here we go. <laughs> Holy cow, that was a big one. <laughs> you might not want to do that around your neighborhood. All right, a couple little hints on this. Uh, this is what just happened. It totally exploded the bottle and the uh, stem came out. The stem is not hurt, but I'm going to have to get a new uh, cap right here. The more air that you can get into this bottle, the bigger the bang. And also sometimes you can always put some baking powder in there or some, you know, ground up chalk or something like that. Um, that might kind of make a cool explosive look. So um, yeah, this is so cool. These are really cheap. Check the link out down below. Um, yeah, I'd probably get, you know, maybe a couple of these packs and then pre-drill some holes and then, um, you know, get a bunch of your water bottles. All right, hey, thanks again for watching the show. We'll talk to you later, adios, goodbye.